Coyote concerns in a local neighborhood. A woman in Sanford says that one of these wild animals killed her cat, and it's not the first time it's happened. Fox 35's Dave Puglisi is live in that neighborhood near Mellonville Avenue tonight. And Dave, the woman says that she's not the only person this has happened to. Ray, you can see here, this is a pretty wooded area, and it's not uncommon to see coyotes, but people now believe these coyotes are targeting their pets, and one woman wants something done about it. The scuffle must have happened here, right out of sight. Just out of sight of her ring doorbell camera, you can see Ashley's 14-year-old three-legged cat, Cordelia, walking around the corner just moments before they believe she was attacked by a coyote. We searched for five hours, and I drove the neighborhood, and... She's gone. Ashley walked us through her wooded backyard where she says she heard the scuffle around midnight. Unfortunately, she believes other neighbors have dealt with the same problem. Neighbors tell me that they've seen them. They've had pets go missing, you know, less than a mile radius. Ashley says she had reached out to FWC for help, but they say there's nothing they can do. Coyotes are considered native wildlife to Florida and are important to the ecosystem. Although they can be relocated or hunted if they're considered a nuisance, but it's the homeowner's responsibility. There's currently uh, nothing in place uh, to do really anything about these pests and that I needed to either trap it myself and dispose of it somehow um, and uh, or or just hire a private trapper. FWC as well as local animal services say coyotes don't like being around people and tend to encroach on homes in search of food. They suggest to walk pets on a short leash and make lots of noise if you see one. If the coyote can't find food, if the coyote uh, gets uh, alarm type sounds when they come near your home, chances are they're not going to come near your home any, anymore. Now she doesn't feel that trapping a few coyotes will be enough to stop them from coming around. She would like the state to look more into other resources like trapping or a bounty program to help residents like herself. In Sanford, Dave Puglisi, Fox 35 News.